Hey guys, my name is Ismos, and today we're going to be exploring this uh, free asset giveaway from Kitbash. If you don't know what Kitbash is, uh, they are the makers of uh, some asset packs uh, that you will see on Instagram, and uh, some of their assets have also been used by a lot of big studios, uh, Hollywood big studios. And uh, let me just play for you. So this is their website, and let me just play for you a quick demo from their website so that you can see uh, the kind of stuff uh, they're making there, uh, so that uh, you get an idea of what exactly they do. So. Now, I'm not sure if you have ever tried building a city or for yourself, but uh, if you try modeling all these assets by yourself, it can take you quite some time. And uh, that's why uh, asset packs like this are very, very important for any studio, 3D studio, uh, because uh, uh, if you look at uh, their pricing compared to what they're giving out, uh, it's quite inexpensive because uh, building something like this could take you a few, I don't know, depending on how many artists you have and uh, uh, how uh, their skill level it can take you quite a long time and uh, just being able to just get these assets uh, for yourself uh, at a very cheap price can be very very cost efficient so today i just want to explore their free asset giveaway that uh, uh, that they're giving out and i've already downloaded uh, one of their free asset giveaways uh, that they have there on their website and uh, this is it uh, we're just going to talk about it for a very small time and uh, just to appreciate uh, the kind of the amount of effort uh, that was put into uh, this work but uh, before we get into that let's first explore some of the other asset packs uh, they have there uh, they also have a library just to show off what uh, their assets have been used for uh, you can just look at the work that has been done here yeah? trying to build uh, this kind of uh, creating a scene like this without an asset pack can take you are quite a lot if it's even possible it may take you even a year if you're going to do it from scratch by yourself but uh, using an asset pack like this can really speed up your workflow also uh, make asset packs if you don't know and uh, have them on my patreon page and also uh, my cg trader uh, account uh, just so uh, to help people just speed up their workflow so that uh, you spend more time uh, creating the art you're trying to, to create rather than going through the technical part of uh, setting up everything. Uh, let's go to their, some of their asset packs uh, that, you, that uh, they have. I, I just wanted to look at uh, this uh, Brooklyn uh, asset pack and you can see it's quite inexpensive compared to what you're getting. Uh, it's around $200 and uh, uh, you get quite a lot of assets, a lot of building assets and uh, they are very very well little. Now this is what you're getting and uh, this is the free version just look at uh, the free version and uh, the resolution of these textures i think is about 8k per, per texture let me just go to the uh, file here Let's see if i can find that just to show you how detailed uh, these assets are now these are some of the assets some of the textures they're using for this project and you can see each texture comes around at 20 mbs and uh, the resolution is about 4K depending on the text you're using and uh, it's 4K times all the PBR uh, versions of that so you have the diffuse, uh, roughness, height map, metal, metalness uh, and uh, to get to what you want here. Okay, so let's look at uh, the assets themselves and just examine uh, the details onto these assets. Remember, these are free assets that you can download from Kitbash and uh, just use them as you want. Now. One of the problems uh, that uh, is the, with, these, uh, with these assets is that they are too large. The texture resolution on these assets is too large. Uh, that, uh, even with my PC, which is not that beefy, uh, I'm using a 1050 Ti uh, graphics card. Uh, that's, I think, 4, 4 GB and uh, an i7 processor. And uh, this is still uh, too heavy for my computer. That uh, I can't preview all the textures, all the models with textures at once. So what I have to do is uh, just isolate a bunch at a time uh, so that I can uh, preview them successfully. Otherwise, uh, my computer just hangs and I can't really do much. I can see even takes a while to 
loading the textures. Okay, so I've just compressed uh, the images uh, to a lesser uh, uh, resolution, less heavy uh, image resolution, uh, so, that I'm, so that I can preview everything uh, at once uh, because I think it looks nicer that way. But uh, uh, if you are not able to preview this in uh, your, on your computer, you can just compress uh, the files using Photoshop. Uh, so that uh, you're able to do that because otherwise it's, it's they are very high resolution images around some are around 8k some are 8 uh, 4k and uh, they are around 360 images so if you're going to load them direct all into blender at once uh it's going to be very heavy on your computer so let's just look at uh, the building and just uh, talk about them for a second just look at uh, the amazing details uh, that you're getting uh, with these uh, projects. Let me see if I can do a quick uh, walkthrough. Uh, if I go to F3, I should be able to do a walk navigation here. Yeah. So what this does, just turns all your navigation keys into a kind of a game. It gives, it gives you the uh, game control keys as your navigation. So let's just uh, find that again. You can use a W S A W D and S uh, to walk around and uh, you can use your middle mouse wheel to control uh, the speed and see all this free of charge to get this is like a their sample uh, just to see this, if you want to see how much the kind of quality they are giving you uh, with their assets uh, this is uh, their kind of demo sample or demo product so we can look at it and uh, i think you're allowed to use it uh, for your own personal use just look at those details there i've turned off most of the effects so that i can easily navigate uh, in, in this yes look at that everything is extra detailed let's look at that detail you have some nice garbage bins here very very small details and uh, a payphone